Salut tout le monde, bienvenue dans un autre pentineur. I'm just kidding. I had to Google translate that. I'm in Montreal now. Um, this is my first official pour back in the saddle um, since the move. I actually unpacked enough to get myself to a point to be able to do a pour. So that was exciting. After a rather long hiatus, I thought, um, I was really hoping to come back with a bang and have a really awesome painting. And I had this like idea in my head of how it was going to go. But uh, like almost every paint pouring video that I've done, um, it never turns out the way that I thought it was going to in my head. Um, it still turned out to be a pretty interesting uh, painting. It just, uh, it didn't do uh, what I wanted it to do, but it gave me an idea, an idea of how it was going to act. Um, so I'm going to try again uh, with my next painting. So in my head, uh, this was going to be a negative space pour, and I was going to put a solid stripe of color uh, across the middle of it without any silicone so there wasn't going to be any cells in one color and then I was going to do some cells around it um, but instead of uh, just dumping the uh, dirty cup all at once I kind of poured it like in a ribbon and it just didn't turn out the way I wanted it to so the majority of this painting actually turned into a swipe which is okay, but you know, it just wasn't what I was hoping for. Um, but overall, I think that I did okay considering it's uh, been like about a week, a week and a half since I've done a pour. And uh, so it's just uh, good to be back in the saddle again. I really uh, miss this paint pouring, so therapeutic. So anyways, there's my little weird spirally ribbony thing. I was actually pretty happy with the cells in the top uh, right corner there, but the rest of it, it just it didn't really do what I wanted it to. And also, I don't know what I was thinking with that spiral thing. I meant to do a completely different shape, but I think I was just so excited about <laughs> doing the paint again. So I, I uh, you know, I panicked and I did a little swirly do thing. Anyways, so I, I realized that the rest of the painting wasn't gonna do. So I started swiping away like crazy. The cells in that top left corner are actually uh, my favorite part of the painting. They just turned out so neat. I really like the teal and the red mixing together like that. <clears throat> Excuse me. So, um, I think that I kind of, I don't know if other people have done this, but uh, I certainly just discovered um, how to kind of do a little bit of a variation on these swipes. Um, I kind of was uh, needing to do like segmented swipes so I just put a little bit of white paint on my stick rather than on the painting and use that to swipe across into the little segments which actually uh, it turned out to work out pretty well so I'm not sure if it really works um, composition-wise. I think that the composition of the paintings are like one of my biggest weaknesses. Um, but I so love the cells in that top left corner. There's some pretty neat ones at the bottom there too that uh, I just couldn't uh, just wipe off this painting. I like those cells too much. 
I think that is interesting that my paintings often reflect my mood. I mean, this one's so chaotic and kind of messy. And that's like my entire place right now. <laughs> Half unpacked and kind of messy and chaotic. Anyways, that about wraps it up. I'll give you a close up of some of those neat cells. I am so happy to be back. I was uh, going through some serious painting withdrawal. So thanks for checking out my new video. I hope you liked it. If you did, remember to hit like and make sure that you subscribe to my channel because there's going to be many more videos to come. Have a great night. Bye.